vintage class right now. And he's racing against his boss, Bob. And he's wearing his dad's old uniform and stuff. So hopefully he gets a good, a good finish and beats his boss. He's pretty badass. So, and then he races again at 2.30, but that's a C Sportsman and he'll be on his Yamaha then. So hopefully we get some wins today. It went pretty good. I got fourth out of four, <laughs> but all in all, I think I'm pretty warmed up for later. What time is that gonna be? 2.30. Uh, this race was an hour, and then my next race at 2.30 is an hour and a half. So about four hours to recoup. I, what was I riding? Yeah. A 1983 KDX 200, and it did good. Uh, the last three laps, it just decided to bog really bad, so I had to time where I was going to jump. Other than that, though, I thought it was catching third place pretty quickly, and then I saw him turn around, and then he was like, "Oh, screw that guy," and then he just took off. So never saw him again. But all in all, it was good. It was a good warm up. It was it was cold at first. Now I'm pretty pretty warmed up. Got the blood going, and now I am enjoying my orange juice. It's good to come out here again, and I expect better results. I rode a lot more in the, within the last three months, so almost twice a week. So if I don't see improvement, I'm doing something wrong. I get a shot of that. So getting ready for my second race at 2.30. See that, hour and a half. Uh, get the seat all ready, fueled up and ready to go. I think it's gonna be great. Shout out to Bitchin' Outdoors for coming out here and filming this again. Uh, it was it's pretty cool to have someone interested in videotaping what your hobbies are. And I just, I mean, I, I couldn't have asked for a better community to be a part of. And I'm just glad to share it with everybody. And thank you, Jake, from behind the camera for coming back here again.